A new boating safety bill in South Carolina is headed to the governor's desk. It passed the Senate earlier this year and then this week the House of Representatives passed the measure. Rashad Williams is live in Greenville County with reaction from boaters and how the bill may impact you. Rashad, what do we need to know? Well, first, it's important to note that the vote in the Senate earlier this year was unanimous, but the vote earlier this week in the House was 97 to 7. There is a lot of issues here with boater safety. We stopped by Lake Hartwell and ran into Dana McMullen, who owns a boat, and she says the new bill will have a positive impact on the next generation of boaters. The more people know about the water before they get on it, the better off we'll be. Within the bill, anyone born after July 1st, 2007 will be required to take a boater education course to operate a boat or vessel of 10 horsepower or more by themselves. Beth Hodges, who also frequents Lake Hartwell with her boat, says this will hopefully make it safer for her and her teenage children. I think it's fantastic. You have to have a driver's license to drive a car. You should have to have a license to drive a boat. It's the same amount of danger. Plus, there's now more alcohol involved, usually with boating. According to SCDNR, there were 170 boat crashes across the state last year. Life jackets, red and green lights, no wake zones, those type things I think everyone should be educated on, especially those who have never been around the water. Comparing 2018 with 2022, boating deaths in the state increased by nearly 50% something Beth says she feels can be reduced with increased education. Everybody needs a little bit more education all the time. And this will also apply to boat rentals and those who may have already completed a boating safety education course in another state, but now it all comes down to the governor signing this into law. Live in Greenville County, Rashad Williams, WYFF News 4.